Hey guys, PC2746 here. Doing a real quick update because it is cold. Uh, I'll show you what I mean. Yeah, look at that out there. <laughs> we just had two blizzards, basically. And so, really nothing done to the rider except for, well, there is one major thing. Let me get the transmission off. Uh, I did buy a pulley for this and some steel and everything. I bought a bunch of parts to finish her up, but I returned them all. Because uh, the rider is gonna go on hold for a while. I'll explain why in a minute. Sorry for that. Um, mainly what happened is I mounted the motor. Sorry for the light, but it's about five o'clock at night. So we got the motor in, it's all bolted down. She ain't going nowhere. I gotta do a carburetor rebuild on her, but like I said, she shut down for right now. Had to cut a chunk out of the hood. Two sections actually. Get on this side. Here's the other piece. You can tell I kinda lost control of the grinder. Oh well. That's a fuel tank. Original fuel tank, thankfully. But like I said, um, that's all I've done to the rider because I just bought something and I had to return pulley uh, tool for the lawnmower to get those stupid C-clip things off. And I also had to return some angle iron I bought for this. It's a total of about $50. Returned all that, one, because the pulley was wrong. Two, because I got a offer. I was offered a car for $50. <laughs> this guy lives above me. Um, and he was given a notice by the police here in Menasha, Wisconsin, that he had had the car gone. Because, the he well, you'll see why. Um, but the car doesn't start. Battery's shot. And uh, he's got until the 11th to get rid of it, so he sold it to me for 50 bucks. Um, let me show you guys. Oh, it's freaking cold. Neighbors pretty warm in their car. This is an Oldsmobile. Let's see if I can get the name. Yeah, that's the name, really crappy. I'll do a better video tomorrow. But uh, yeah, this thing's been basically sitting here for God knows how long. Well, I know how long, a couple of, couple of months. Uh, as you can tell, previous accident. No headlights, bumper is currently sitting on the ground. Come on. Yeah, bumper's effed up. Coming off, hood's barely being held in. All alignment issues in the front end now. Oh, that's not the car, here it is. But, like I said, battery shot. Oh God, I can't see nothing. So, what I'm gonna do is I am going to get a junkyard battery in the next few days and just use my battery out of my Ford to uh, put in. Uh, see if it fires up. If it fires up, I will debate on rebuilding it or just throw some headlight assemblies in, replace the bumper, and just sell it. Um, but there are certain things I have to do to it. Uh, serpentine belt is right about to break. Excuse me. Uh, so I will be doing a video, which don't ask when it's coming out, because I don't know, because I have to first yank the old one out. This is easy, just cut the thing. Take a nice slice, done. Paint the butt one is you have to move a motor mount and drop the motor slightly to get the new one in. So I'll make a video of it. Don't know how long it's going to take me because first off I got to see if the car even starts. If the car doesn't even start, I'm not wasting my time replacing a serpentine belt. You know, why, why do that? So I'll do a better video for you guys tomorrow. All right, talk to you guys later.